crawl back from this deficit. Lots of pressure coming out as well. You see that rook in the corner over on h6? That or Oh, oh his ass is coaching. This board is uh, upside down. It's going to throw me off a little bit. At least white's in the bottom right, so that's okay. But <laughs> Maybe that's the strat. I need to start coaching whoever's losing. So uh, don't hang any pieces. <laughs> All right, let's get into this game one. Immediate aggression coming out with Tarachi on that upbeat. Really risky to do in some cases, but in this situation, Arpeggio really was not in a situation to do much about it. Yeah, he's kind of being careful with the snake running away with the projectiles. I mean, most snakes do that, though. This is so frustrating if you're Arpeggio, because Tarachi is really good at using that healing mechanic. Yeah. We've already seen him get significant healing off of it. Beautifully timed air dodge from Arpeggio. He knows that timing really well. I'm also watching that C4 on the ledge, but so is Tarachi, I'm sure. Is he gonna go for it? Oh, he's just standing on it. That is a brave man right there. It looks there. like Arpeggio is coming closer to Tarachi, trying to hit him with being aware of the absorb. Yeah, he has to play really carefully because a lot of times, you know, snake players get in the habit yeah. of just throwing like, out just, this like, projectile. Run away and then Projectiles. It's their whole neutral game plan, make them come to you, but he doesn't really get that in this situation. He has to play a much more honest neutral game. Yeah. But he's doing it. Tarachi overextending, trying to do a crazy Psy Magnet combo there, and he doesn't get it. Okay, we're back to even. Yeah. Alright, Peggyo. Ar I already forgot how to pronounce his name. Arpeggio. Arpeggio is our. Okay. Arpeggio is already throwing out more projectiles, except he's mixing up between projectiles and using and going melee. I love that option select from Tarachi. If that hit, it hit, and if it doesn't, he can just move it around and get away. Again, recovering damage. He's only got 35 now. Yeah. Yeah, Tarachi's smart with uh, when to recover his damage. Like, yeah, it's, it's like it's easier because he's playing against the snake too. Yeah, but you're right. It's so are always throwing out projectiles. It's so easy to just get in the habit of spamming that option yeah. using the Psy Magnet, and Arpeggio is going to take and that it, to the bank and get it. can definitely be punishable. Yeah, it's super punishable. We already saw it once. Arpeggio yeah. took the first stock that way. I think he was expecting, like, a, a grenade Z-drop. And Have we seen any up smashes yet? Ooh, that was so good. We have not. Okay. Here we are making fun of Tarachi and his up smash tendency, and he's just... Not giving it to us. Is that a grenade? Okay. <laughs> that face. Maybe not an up smash, but an up smash. I love how emotive Arpeggio is in the uh, the player cam. Yup, bob that head. I got grabbed. Yup, I got hit with the up air. Bob the head again. What do you think Arpeggio's <laughs> internal monologue is head? right now? Move his head to the side. <laughs> I can just see, like, the uh, internal frustration. Like, this character's so BS. Every time I throw a grenade, he just heals off of it. Oh, yeah, PK freeze again. What am I going to do about that? That move's so big. Of course, he just throws out PK fire. I can't land. I can't throw projectiles. My grenade's useless. And, of course, he hits me again. <laughs> no, honestly, Arpeggio's doing a great job of not getting flustered. Obviously, very emotive guy, but that's just kind of how Arpeggio is. Okay, he's living. Yeah, <laughs> Karachi just again. waited that out, yeah. Arpeggio doesn't... He, he seems frustrated with how much he's healing. It's so hard now if you're in Arpeggio's situation. Yeah, because, like, Snake is mostly projectiles, so it's like... Yeah, this is a situation where he wants to sit back and nickel and dime. But he yeah. had to hold forward because as soon as he started doing that, Tarachi just started healing damage. Oh, hold up, though. This chess game, it's turning around. White's got those pieces now. Bit of a material advantage. I can't see too closely what's happening on the board, but it looks like, yeah, that's an honest material advantage. Uh, Black is, I think, in the winning position at the moment with all that coaching. I think I'm going to hop off and then I'll get back on soon. It's been good, my guy. Three, two, one, go! 
All right, game two on FD. Now this is an interesting stage for Arpeggio to go to because traditional snake wisdom says don't go to FD traditionally in most matchups because you can get juggled really hard here. But I guess in this matchup, I don't know the the Lucas matchup super well, but I think he feels like maybe the, the combination of like the floatiness of Karachi and all the stuff he can get off of platforms makes it worth doing. Cloud, are you a Lucas hater? Wait, why do you hate Lucas? How much of that Lucas hate is just because you got sauced a little bit too hard? <laughs> I don't know, I love Lucas. I also just have like this, I guess it's not super true in Smash Ultimate, but I had so much respect for Lucas just because of Smash 4. Lucas players, oh yeah, okay, yeah, down smash is a, a little bit. As a Spacey's player, I can appreciate down smash hate. Uh, oh, there's the Tarachi up smash, yeah. Even Arpeggio is laughing, he knows. It just covers everything. I wanna see more. I bet it on five up smashes and Tarachi's making me a liar right now. Though with the, ex the success of that one, maybe he'll go for another one. I guess it really comes down to whether or not we get three games here. Because in two games, it's hard to get out five up smashes. Arpeggio trying his own down smashes at the ledge, but it's not working out. Tarachi keeps finding a way to get back. Tried to juggle Arpeggio, but those juggling games not working out super well for Tarachi on this stage. I feel like maybe the, uh, the counter pick was pretty effective for Arpeggio here. He's currently in the, the lead. He's not getting as nickel and dime for these heals by Tarachi. I don't know how much of that's adaptation, how much of it's the stage, but whatever the case, whatever Arpeggio is doing is working. That PK freeze though, if we had an, an over under on that, my man is spamming that move. There's down smash. Nice dash up to do that down smash as well. I was not ready for that. And clearly Arpeggio wasn't either. Goes for the spike on the back air, doesn't get it. And now he's gonna pay for it a little bit as Arpeggio tries to carefully maneuver those projectiles around his ability to absorb them. Managed to do it, but he didn't manage to hit him. And now PK Freeze is right back online. I feel like Tarachi is overusing that move just a little bit. In that situation, something like up air seemed a bit better for juggling, but at the same time, it's working out pretty well for him. 69%, nice damage on Arpeggio, but Tarachi needs to make it happen fast. There we go, the second up smash. Is he gonna close out this game with a third, perhaps? We're gonna see three up smashes in a row in this game. Oh, I saw the startup frames. And there it is, yeah! The Tarachi up smash coming out. Love to see it. I guess we'll call that a mix up. <laughs> Arpeggio <laughs> miming the down smashes there in the player cam. Oh, my man is not pleased with this character. What a tricky matchup for Arpeggio to, to navigate. Honestly, I feel like he played really well. But Arpeggio utilized the advantages his character has really well and really used those smash attacks as well. Several smash attack kills throughout that set. One nice down smash from Arpeggio at the ledge there, managing to use a little bit of Tarachi's own medicine against him, but then right again, the F smash into up smash. Like, that's just a Tarachi classic there. Following up with another down smash and then wait for it. Wait for it. Another Tarachi up smash right now. And Arpeggio just knows that's coming a mile away.